Okay, Aaron, this is my digital that I want to show you and share some practices that I've been studying. I like cartoons, so I would probably show sharing some cartoon into my extras. They only ask for about 5 or 10, so I, I just recommend you doing one per page, or you could try doing four per page, but do like a, a one character, like four different studies, and line drawing. I only have a tablet, so I would recommend you buying a tablet as well for your home. You could practice a color, but you might have to buy some brushes from people. The goal would be to get a Cintiq for yourself, but I, not too many students can't afford that. That's what they, they take our part-time classes that have these types of programs. And layouts. You're gonna do a lot of layout. You might like something like character design, but you still have to do layout. So I recommend bone drawing for animation. At least have one good drawing of an animal. Do I have any other animals? This, this doesn't have to be a color, but it's hard to find good color brushes. So you can always just do like a a little color sample. I like to show a little bit of shading. So I would show them a little bit cartoon, a little bit Disney. But if you like anime, you can show them anime. If you like Mickey Mouse, you can show them Mickey Mouse. And show them something like actual layout or a cartoon layout. If you an actual layout might be a bit hard. So you could try to find like a cartoon you like and get some snaps from it, some pictures, and try to draw it out in the same style. And I'll probably show them a couple things like this if I were to submit again. I never got it graded on my digital, so because I never had a digital tablet when I applied. I just started learning on a tablet about two years ago, so when I did my art school, they never had a tablet or digital but now they might so people taking art school now they might uh, give you uh, more advanced stuff to work on on tablets so you might be lucky now back then it was light drawing, sculpture, print making and stuff like that we never had a tablet or a computer so the people going to school now are lucky but they have to pay probably more different supplies, you need more supplies, cost go up, so best advice I could give you is to add some digital but I mainly teach uh, drawing, so I could teach you a little bit of digital, but I only have a tablet my, myself, so and this is my work, I've been upgrading myself so I don't know how my skills would be if I do get to try a Cintiq. I don't know, never have been able to, but if you do, you're one of the lucky ones. Thanks for watching my tips and tricks. How to add a digital, mostly you can add digital to your extras, but rest of your portfolio, I recommend doing it in pencil. So you don't need to uh, do it all in digital. So if they mark you on both skills, pencil and digital, I never submitted digital, so I never had a chance to learn it, so I only picked it up uh, like a couple years back on the tablet, so it's lucky.